I don't think the Hummers are too happy. <laughs> I wonder how many times they'll get buzzed. Good morning, friends. Welcome back to the farmhouse. I am running out to the garden to harvest some peppers, both some hot peppers, and I think we have some bell peppers too. But they are working, or they're going to be working on the siding and the roof again today. And yeah, another day on the homestead, more adventures and more trouble to get into. They started here this morning and then stopped when they got to the roof line. I think they're, they said they're gonna do the roof tomorrow. So they did this. Gonna do a caterpillar check. Ooh, we need milkweed. Look at that. That one's a chunk. Ooh, and then, oh, camera will focus. There you go. Let me go get some milkweed for these guys. Oh no. This had an egg on it. I hope they didn't. I bet they did. So I've never seen this or had this happen before, but there was an egg on this piece of milkweed and I think they ate it. Wow. There's an egg there too. Yikes. I put in some new milkweed. There's a couple of eggs on this. And I know there's some couple eggs over here. And yeah, oh. I found this chunky guy when I went to cut the milkweed. So we're gonna add him in here as well. Put him right here. I think we're at the point where we need to add milkweed just about every day. Maybe they didn't eat it. Maybe he actually hatched. Cause look at those two little babies. Granddad found another use for the tractor this morning. They uh, are gonna work on the roofs today. He said he probably should have put another implement on the back of the tractor because the um, shingles are heavy. That's what Jane was just telling him. He should have put a something on the back. That's the roof that they're going to do right up there. planted both um, like sweet bell peppers and 
on this side. And then on this side are the jalapenos habaneros. So what I am going to do is I'm gonna harvest both. We also had our banana peppers in here, but we had so many banana peppers that I told Jamie to pull the plants out because I just couldn't, couldn't deal with any more. But these seem to be doing pretty well. We have some good peppers. You can see down there on the bottom. So I'm gonna go through and harvest all of these. And then I think with the habaneros, cause there's some really nice ones in here. You can see right here. With the habaneros, I'm gonna make some hot sauce. Jalapenos, I am going to dice them up and freeze them so we can make um, jalapeno cheddar bagels. And I'm not sure what I'm gonna do with the bell, with the bell peppers yet. We'll have to see about those. But I'm gonna start with the habaneros jalapenos. too shabby on the pepper harvest. There are so many more habaneros in there in like another week or two. We're gonna have tons, but not too bad for today. While I'm out here, I wanna show you guys this. This is beer, I think there's three plants there. Um, these are the eggplants. So they kind of got overshadowed by the spaghetti squash. And now that we ripped the spaghetti squash out, they are doing Great, and we even have a little flower right there. So maybe we'll get some eggplants this year too. It is really hot today, and you can definitely tell that these guys are struggling to get this roof done. Um, it's late afternoon now, and they are just, it is hot, I don't blame them. So still working on the roof, and the kids are enjoying their last, well, second to last day of summer by swimming in the pool and just enjoying being kids. And of course, because we're sitting at the pool, I of course have to go, I have to go check on the monarchs. And I found three monarch caterpillars, like three chunky ones. And then I found two baby ones. And we also had a hummingbird visit us while we were at the pool. If you guys didn't know, September 3rd is National Hummingbird Day. So I'd love to know what you guys are doing to celebrate. Let us know in the comments below. It is Friday, so it is pizza night. I am making my Aunt Libby's pizza dough recipe. It has kind of become a staple. I would hesitate to even say that we love this more than we love sourdough pizza. It is just that good. If you want to check out the recipe for this, I have left a link below for you, and I will link it at the end of this video. Thank you guys so much for hanging out with us at the farmhouse today, and we will talk to you soon.